Hi everybody, welcome back. We are gonna be making a soy glazed chicken. So I've already pounded my chicken breast and uh, put a little salt and pepper on them and just dredging them in the flour real quick. I have my oil heated up. in there as well. Now I did put a, a pepper on these and very little salt because we are making a glaze and so I didn't want it to be too salty. The original recipe I found, um, it's been a while ago now, it was just called glazed chicken, but there's a lot of glazes out there, and this one's main ingredient is soy. So I went with that as the title. So I'm going to take this and plate it, and then we're going to work on the sauce. So I'll bring you right back. Okay, so we're going to put a little olive oil in. And let that heat up a little bit. It's already pretty warm. The skillet was warm already. So let's drop in some onions. fresh ginger. I do have powder, so I'm going to grab that. Alright, 
now let's go ahead and get our soy sauce. We're going to use two and a half tablespoons of soy sauce. And then some hoisting salt. water. And I want to add some chicken base. in the jar so I'm just going to see if I can rinse the jar out and use what's left. It's a little less than the recipe calls for but with all the flavors I think it'll be fun. So I'm going to add some cornstarch. It did call for some sugar as well. A tablespoon each of honey and sugar. So let me grab that. You could also use brown sugar. I actually prefer the brown, but I didn't have it here handy. So we're going with the regular sugar. And the recipe actually calls for regular. I just uh, tend to use brown in these recipes. Just think it goes better with the soy and the hoisin. I don't know why. Got a clump of ginger there, so we'll let that cook down and break that up. Now I'm going to go ahead and put the chicken back in now while it's cooking down. It's 
good. I still think it could use some brown sugar. Some Splenda, um, Splenda with a mixed with brown sugar. I'm going to add some of that. Not much since it has white sugar in it already. I'm going to give it add a little stir. This really calls for four pieces of chicken. This is just the chicken I had left over. So we're going to have more sauce than's needed. I'm going to let that um, cook down. Let's give it another taste. Perfect. Alright, I'm going to get the rice cooked and get this plated up. Okay guys, so here it is. And um, it's very easy as you saw. It's very tasty. So I hope you guys will give this a try. And if you notice, I am serving it with rice. But I did not put a, uh, fry the rice or put a sauce on it. Because of the excess sauce I had on the chicken. That's going to be plenty to uh, flavor that rice when you take a bite. All right, I hope you guys have a great week, and I'll see you next week.